everybody, this is Tanya Ortiz with the Facebook group Create Your Own Economy Today, as well as the forum www.createyourowneconomytoday.com. I'll say it again because I know I talk super fast. Okay, Facebook group, if you haven't, go to Create Your Own Economy Today. For those of you, for whatever crazy reason, you just don't like Facebook, you little weirdos. <laughs> just joking. Go to www. Create your own economy today.com. Now, if the Facebook group is a little too fast for you, because I know it's super fast, um, you can go to the forum and we have two very helpful women, uh, Vanilla as well as Cookie Crumbs, were very helpful in the forum, and that's Create Your Own Economy Today. Now, many of you want to know what pennies out 629. Sorry, I got something in my eye. Wet pennies out 629. I'm sorry, 630. Wet pennies out 630. Okay, I want to go over some house rules first. We have a lot of newbies, and uh, some people are ending up in the land of banishment because they are not reading the pin post. Okay, so if you're brand new, I really need you to go to your top of your phone or the top of your laptop or computer, and at the very top, very first post, it'll say pinned, P-I-N-N-E-D, pin post. I need you to click on it and read it. Now, if you want to, want to know where uh, certain threads are, say we have a coupon thread, a Kohl's thread, a Walmart thread, um, we have a dumpster diving thread, we have a glitch thread, um, we have a basket thread. All kinds of threads. If you want to find a certain thread, you need to go to the pin post. Questions. I greatly appreciate it if you guys would keep the questions, general questions, in the questions thread, okay? Just let's try to clean up the wall, keep them in the questions thread. You may ask a question. You may not take a picture of an item while you're in a store and say, hey, everybody, is I'm, I'm, in, I'm at the Dollar General. Is this a penny? That'll put you in the land of banishment. You can't do that. You may ask. Hey everybody, I'm at the Dollar General. I see a yellow unicorn with orange hair and a sunshine on his behind with blue eyes. Is he a penny? You may ask questions like that. You may not ask a question with a picture that will get you kicked out. All right, so we all got the house rules. Oh, one more house rule. If you add someone, you have to tell them to go to the pen post, read the pen post and explain what the group is before you add that person. If you add someone to the group and they go crazy and they start talking crazy and you haven't explained nothing to them and they don't even know why they're in the group, then they'll get kicked out and you'll get kicked out as well for adding that person. So it's up to you if you add someone in because it shows us who added who to explain what the group is about. Don't just go throwing in all your friends without an explanation because as soon as they mess up, that's your behind on the line. All right, so we got that out the way. Now, I'm going to go over one quick minute, because I know we have a lot of newbies, uh, of how penny shopping works. Okay, so let's just say, hypothetically, this unicorn is on the list, and you see 20 of them. This is what you may not do. You may not say, hmm, I see 20 of these, but I'm kind of unsure. I'll just put one in my cart, and if that one rings up, I'll go back and get the rest. No, 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 no. You know why? Because if you don't take them all and put them in your cart, their policy is they don't have to let you go back and get the rest. So you need to, if you see 100 unicorns or 100 penny items, whatever you see, wipe out the shelf, put it in your cart. You may say, but Tanya, suppose it's not a penny. Suppose it's full price. If they scan it, it's full price. Say, I'm sorry, I thought it was on sale. I'll put the rest back. You do not leave it in your cart. You don't leave it for the salespeople to put away. You don't call corporate and argue with the people. Don't call corporate, don't call corporate. It was a year ago, last May, We uh, Dollar General had 3,000 phone calls in a month. And guess what? Uh, we had no penny items. No penny items in the month of May, last year. So do not call corporate. Uh, if they are nasty or they won't scan your penny items, just get the cheapest thing you can find, like a 50 cent or you know, pack of bubble gum. And there's a survey at the bottom. Here's why I tell people to do the surveys. Do the survey because the district manager and corporate, the district manager has a conference call with all the managers every week about the surveys. He'll, the district manager will get the survey quicker any phone call that you will make. Okay, you make a phone call. I did that when I first started penny shopping. I made a phone call and it was a long time before the district manager even got it. 
when I started doing surveys, they started recognizing it immediately. Okay, so bad service, do the survey. Good service, do the survey. All right, we just don't want to be a bunch of, you know, negative Nancy penny shoppers. So if you have good service, do the survey, and they'll appreciate you, and they'll recognize you the next time you came in, next time you come in. I had, uh, this was last year when uh, purple dots were a quarter. I had a manager who was just wonderful to me. I mean, she like pointed everything out, helped me load it in my cart. And I gave her a wonderful survey. Well, let me tell you, here we are a year later. Um, if it's, I could go back into that same store and she will help me out. So it does help. They do remember you. All right. So we all, and okay. So a lot of people are wondering why are things a penny? Well, let's just say this is on a shelf. It should have been uh, given a charity. So they say, or where it usually goes to in the dumpster. So it's be pulled off the shelf and put in a dumpster. And the manager, for whatever crazy reason, didn't read the memo, um, is just lazy, and just left it on a shelf. You come in and you see it. This is what you don't do. You don't hit the door. You just say, hey, where's all your penny items? Or you don't pick up the phone and say, is today your penny shell? No, these are items that are supposed to be pulled. And you just so happen to find them. And once they ring up on the register, then they end up a penny so we all understand that all right so everybody's like Tanya shut up and tell us what's a penny what is a penny let me get my handy dandy notebook from cousin Gus what does it say nothing psych 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 we do have some pity items available June the 30th what is a pity okay ready mobile headset now this is the $40 one all right the ready mobile headset this is the $40 dollar one uh our skills gym stripes the purple one our skills learning charts our skills gym stripes tiara and our skills gems and hearts i will post this underneath the video so you don't have to be scratching your head saying what did she say but at least y'all know we have one two three four five penny items in uh the mobile ready cell phone um the $40 one, that is going to be one, a good one to look for. So I'm excited about that. So uh, there, before you guys go, I do want to talk about something. Now, if you go back, let's just say three months ago, four months ago, you will see that Tanya Ortiz was 32 pounds heavier. Okay? I'm getting private messages like crazy. Hey, Tanya, I saw you lose weight. How'd you lose weight? Too easy, guys. Drops, these drops. How do you get to drops? Go to lose weight with Tanya Ortiz.com. Again, lose weight with Tanya Ortiz.com. Now, I need people to uh, pay attention when it comes to this because uh, I have very specific instructions. If you only want to be a customer, click here. If you want to lose weight and make money at the same time, that's what I do, uh, click here. Many of you guys are clicking the wrong one and then you're confused when I contact you. So again, uh, what you do is you, if you only want to be a customer, follow the correct link and click that link. If you want to make money and lose weight, follow the collect, correct link and that is lose weight with Tanya Ortiz.com. All right. Now, after more instructions, after you bought a buy your bottle of ACG, I need you to do a few things. One, I need you to send me a Facebook friend request and a private message saying, I bought the ACG, add me to the group. Don't try to be slick and tell me you bought it and didn't buy it because I check the list before I add anybody into my group. Okay, I've had some women say they bought the drops and they didn't. So I do check. Um, after you do that, I have a free ebook that anyone Everybody can read, not just for the people who buy the drops, but for anybody who wants more information about the ACG diet, go to lose weight with tanyortiz.com and click on pounds and inches. It's a 42 page ebook, pounds and inches. I have the whole book for free on my site, and that'll give you a better understanding of what the ACG diet is. Okay, now I am going to ask that you guys share this video. Why? Because one, let's just say somebody uh, financially they're in a bind and they come across this video and I'm talking about the Ready Mobile headsets. It's $40 at the Dollar General and they could find, let's just say, five of them, $200 worth, 
four, five, six. They only have five cents. They can go through McDonald's drive-thru and pick up a nickel and they go to Dollar General and get $200 worth and then turn around and sell it. They have now created their own economy and you have blessed that person with some information. So I'm going to ask you guys to share this video. I want you to share it on your Facebook page, your personal page, share it on YouTube, share it on Pinterest, and share it on Twitter. Let's get the information out because even with our Facebook group alone, the couponing, the dumpster diving, the discount shopping, the glitches, I mean, just with all the information, it's a wealth of knowledge as well as our forum. It's a wealth of knowledge there as well. So I am going to ask that everybody share this on your personal page, uh, you know, this video, because you may bless somebody else that's financially struggling and they could glean from the information that we have on a forum as well as a Facebook group. So I hope you guys are happy with the penny list. Um, I am excited about one item of the five. So I'll be searching for the cell phones. So um, I am going to ask that Tuesday underneath this video that you guys post pictures of what you bought. Okay. So please, please, please underneath the video on Tuesday morning when you're at the Dollar General, make sure you post pictures. All right. So take care. God bless. See you guys later. Bye-bye.